this is gonna be a nice episode. If I remember mm. certain parts of this game correctly, this is gonna be awesome. Good. <laughs> for for you. Oh 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 really? <laughs> it's oh. gonna be hilarious. Oh good. I guess I'll just lube up my throat then. <laughs> <laughs> Best intro ever. Mm. Chris Master 4, I'm gonna lube up my throat now. <laughs> Ugh. Please don't drink lube. <laughs> <laughs> Why do you always say funny shit when I'm drinking water? <laughs> it just popped into my brain. I was like, I should say this. Kids, you know, whatever kids are watching this game. First of all, don't watch this. This is not old enough for you. It's not old. You're not old enough for this. Not. It's not old enough for you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're not old enough to watch this. Second of all, don't drink lube. Second of all, third of all, don't even look up lube to drink. <laughs> um, but no, hello everybody. This is Christian Master Four here. You know, for those left after listening to that amazingness, <laughs> welcome back to Let's Play Danger Rapper Two: Goodbye Despair Disease. And here we have someone. Did you change my name? It's no longer that guy. It's someone. I like it. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you. So yeah, this is the disease edition of Danganronpa, where three of our cast members are clearly... Uh, and Ibuki's a robot now. Yeah, Ibuki's a robot. And Nagito's a valley Na girl Na crazy, Na Nagi man. Nagito's a, mute, a muted talker who's also a valley girl. When he's crazy. And when he's crazy, and Akane is just cowardly. You know what? I should give her the cowardly line. <laughs> What? Yes, you should. I should. I should. It's like put him up. Put him up. It's almost. It's almost basically Gundam's voice. But I'll, yes, it I'll is. You should do it. it. Something like that. I have a lot of voices that I just haven't used. Huh? I suddenly woke up, and if I woke up, that means I fell asleep without realizing it. Earlier, I discussed it with Fuyuhiko, and we decided we take turns resting. That's right. That's why I came to the on-call room. In the second floor of the hospital. I haven't been sleeping well the past few days, so a sudden drowsiness overtook me. And I was asleep, which is a good thing, but my body feels really heavy for some reason. Oh no. No, it's not just heavy. It feels somewhat soft and uh <laughs> his hair Uh I Told you it was gonna uh, be a good episode. <laughs> I told you, hilariously good episode. <laughs> I had a feeling <laughs> it was gonna be a hilariously good episode. Look at his hair. His hair is great. Give me a minute. Now go back. <laughs> Give me a minute. Go back. Look at his hair. I I see his hair boner, Joe. <laughs> She's just. Oh this my is God. this is what you wish you were. You were actually Hajime, don't you? This is a fucking you? precious picture. You wish you were actually Hajime at this point, don't you? I mean, switch the positions and yeah. <laughs> <laughs> She's sleeping softly. Me, God. He can't breathe. Oh God. <laughs> She's suffocating him to death. Wait, is he suffocating him with his with her legs? Because yes. clearly her breasts are not close enough to his. Oh face. yeah, he can't he can't breathe in. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> Mikon, stop it! <laughs> I can't breathe! Mm. No, 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 you can't! Don't move around! God, stop it! Huh? Ah! <laughs> you know, now you're supposed to make her look awake. Ew! <laughs> oh, that was a good scene. Uh, uh, Hajime, are you okay? Your complexion is a blemish purple shade. It might be a severe cyanotic reaction. Hajime, can you hear me? Get a hold of yourself. Mikan finally got off of me, grabbed my shoulders, and began shaking me intensely. Because <laughs> that's what you do after almost suffocating someone. She didn't know. I know. Somehow that was enough for me to get my conscience to drift back to reality. Ugh. Ugh. Hajime! You freaking consciousness! I am so glad! I, I thought you died! Me too. I seriously thought I was gonna die. Your thick thighs! They're so strong! I'm sorry, I thought about taking a rest in the on-car room, but you were already asleep, so... That doesn't 
doesn't mean you can climb on top of me. And I'll be on the <laughs> This does not sound like the Mikan I know. She would never have said that. I'll be on the bottom next time. Uh, That's seriously not what I'm talking about. Hey, hey. Hey. <laughs> what are you guys doing? For you, Hiko. No, this... I, I really hope you don't get the wrong idea. Don't tell me. Are you guys sleeping together? Bastard! You dirty rotten bastard! You guys are fucking high school students! He's not wrong! Seriously, you've got this all wrong. That's also a cliche that's like in every kind of scene like this. Yes, it is. It. We don't have time for that. Nagito, he's in danger! What? When I peeked inside his room earlier, it looked like he was, wasn't was breathing. <laughs> huh? Huh? Oh, this is bad. This is bad! Now's the time for us to rest! Mikon vigorously leapt out of bed and ran on the on-call room. That, that's not very like her, is it? What are you talking about? I don't know. I'm trying to find diseases in people. <laughs> I want everyone to get this disease. I, I, I want So it. you can do the deep voice to Mikon! Oh. I want- Hajime, Hajime, now's not the time for you to be pitching a tent! <laughs> <laughs> we need to hurry! Seriously, I'm not! <laughs> oh. The mic change fits up as like a weird noise. The first six minutes of this episode are what- The best. Be I told you I had a good feeling about this episode being funny. <laughs> Nagito, please get a hold of yourself! Despite Mikan's desperate pleas, I didn't see Nagito react at all. Don't tell me! There's no way he died, right? The body discovery announcement isn't playing, right? Fidget, fidget! <laughs> he literally said fidget! Damn it, he's totally waiting for it. Damn it! <sighs> this looks very bad. I know that was his voice, but he's so waiting for him to actually be dead. I talked to Mikan. I talked to Mikan, not dead body. He's not dead yet! Damn it! So, what's Mikan's, uh, diagnosis? Hang on. Yeah, prepare with your, uh... <laughs> this is gonna be a Mikan... <laughs> Mikan heavy episode. Uh, oh god, if this is gonna be a Mikan centric episode, my throat's gonna die. This is the last good thing. This is a good thing I decided this was gonna be the last episode to end on this session. Yep. Hmm. Oh. It's only been what like, three hours or two hours? Three hours of recording? Holy fuck. <laughs> no, we were no we started recording at nine. Eight thirty. Oh no, it was eight forty. And it's almost Still, eleven. It's it's all it's almost three hours. Oh my god. Fuck. This game is long. Mikon, is Nagito alright? Uh, uh, uh. It looks like his breathing has returned. Really? But still, his condition is unpredictable, and that's what's putting it lightly. Hey! Hey! How light is that? Is it sweet potato soft? Well... If so, that's pretty light. Uh, uh, Please don't interfere! Hey. And it looks like, isn't Nagito's mouth moving? Or isn't Nagito's mouth moving? I know you lie. Your lips are moving. <laughs> You're right, he might be trying to say something. <laughs> what happened? As soon as she said his name, Mikan softly tilted her ear towards Nagito's lips. And then you just hear... This <laughs> 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 how he's infecting people. <laughs> <laughs> it's the fucking Gary him tongue. What did he say? Um, apparently his condition has improved. And he feels quite refreshed. But he's got liar disease. I'm gonna, I'm gonna lower her timber a bit this time, because my throat cannot handle. Constantly talking like this. Yeah, you can tell my voice is like mm -hmm. dying. Yes. Ugh. In fact, the demonstration. That throat the up. demonstration was pretty. Yes, yeah, so I'm gonna lube my throat up. <laughs> demonstration. Was that not WD40 a good idea. down the hatch. <laughs> that would also be very toxic. <laughs> Mm. Um. Mm. Uh, since Monokuma said Nagito is the liar disease. Uh oh. He probably means the opposite and actually feels really crappy. Like. What's gonna happen if he just dies? We're not gonna have a class trial, right? <laughs> Don't talk. Oh god. My <laughs> voice like kind of stopped halfway through. <laughs> it did. Don't talk like that. Yes. Nagito is never going to die. 
I will save him by any means necessary. I see. Got it. I'll leave Nagito's life up to you. Yes. Aw. Oh. Far from her usual self, not me conversated Shit. assertively and went back to tending Nagito. Well. If we stay here any longer, econ. then we Oh my <laughs> It looks like you may actually then get follow to me. I think she might have gotten the disease. <laughs> While you're arresting, the goods arrived. I gotta show them to you. The goods? Anyway. You know, all of Nagito's drugs were shipped in. Gotcha. Let's check on Mikan again. She's, she's not assertively stuff. Okay. That's a bit more assertive than normal. You're really trying to figure out if she's got yes, the disease. Yes, I'm trying to figure out if she's got the disease. I mean, as much as I want to believe that, I think... <sighs> I want to check on Abuki. But you cannot. For an Akane. And this is where Fuyuhiko was. Mm-hmm. I can go in there. You can you can check on Ibuki too. Are you sure it's smart to go into the room with the fucking sick people? What the fuck is she wearing? She's wearing a patient scarf. So she's basically naked underneath, but yes. wearing a patient scarf. But why is why Fuyuhiko would you go here? Why would you still show cleavage? It's supposed to cover you up entirely. <laughs> because anime. <laughs> I'm scared. I don't want to be in the hospital. Why I want to go home? <laughs> That's her voice. It's gonna be okay. You don't have to worry. Fuhiko and I are here, so don't cry. <laughs> it's such a horrible and like loop of sound. It's not horrible. It's just it's it's good the first time, but when you're constantly hearing it over and over again, it gets hilarious. <laughs> 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 now we're just making fun of people crying. Good job. Good job. <laughs> good job. Us. High five. <laughs> Could have been better. I like. I had to reach around. I, I know. <laughs> Just the whole fucking reach around. Anyway, I've never seen Akane cry like that, but I don't really know what to do. Hugger. There's bananas over here. I don't know why there are bananas over you here. You can't click on them. But there's bananas over here. I understand you're worried, but there's nothing we can do here. Anyway. The goods. Yeah. Oh, the communication thing, maybe. Probably. But I want to check on Ibuki. Ibuki. So she's so she's just standing up and crying. Shouldn't she, she shouldn't shouldn't she be in bed? Nope. Ibuki's probably just you know. You're not sick. Okay. <laughs> God. She's she has a flower in her room. I think that's good to know. Yes. You came to visit and see how I am doing. Thank you very much for your courtesy. She also has got a little bit of drool coming out of her mouth, too. Mm -hmm. Oh, is, is it okay for you to be awake? You should be resting in bed. Understood. Thank you very much for your consideration. I shall heed your kind attitude and take a rest. Compared to Nagito, Ibuki seems fine. Are there individual differences in symptoms, too? Yes. Probably. And are you going to say the same thing as before? Mm -hmm. Jeez. Yep. Any uh. All right, let's go get our uh, f cell phones. Our amazing cell phone. Are they gonna be like iPad huge? Walkie talkies. And walkie talkies would actually make more sense, but there were cell phones. <laughs> They're gonna be just a giant brick breaker thing. What? A giant game of brick breaker. That's how you communicate. You, if you beat a level, there, it sends the there, other person. There's something right there. Why it's beeping? Why the fuck is it beeping over there? Oh, because it's the lights. Wait, no, I can't be the. Is that the light coming off of the top one? Because it looks like a fish. Wait, can, you, you say that looks like a fish, right? I don't know what the hell that is. It looks like a fish. Like, you can see it, right? Mm-hmm. Okay. I mean, when you said good. Damn right. Look on the top of the reception desk. Yeah. It's the things that are beeping. He was talking about this, right? It looks like a monitor yeah, the and a camera, camera unit. It's also in the form of a fucking PSP. PS Vita. I don't almost. Think that's not a PS Vita. It's not a PSP either. PSP had Because a PS Vita, a the PSP buttons are on the side, not underneath it. Is it just PSP it's actually, have the buttons underneath? Okay, it's like a pink PS... Well... What? Does the PSP have the buttons underneath? Like, in that configuration? I've though? seen a PS Vita. The, the I buttons know the are... Vita has them on the side, but I mean... 
the PSP, I think Does so. it have that configuration of buttons, though? I, I'm pretty sure it has at least the, the face button, like, all the face buttons it has, and the D-pad buttons. Um... It's not the PSP Go, because it looks more like a DS. Yeah. Um... Fuck that thing. Perfect timing, the blue light's blinking. It's been blinking since we got here. Something happened when this blinks? Seeing is believing, as they say. Try pressing the button just below that light. You just have to press the button? Why are you questioning? Just push the damn button! Hajime, I hate you. Is, does he have, like, what the I, fuck's going he's on? He's got, he's got dumb disease, that's what <laughs> he has. He's got dumbass disease. Dumbass disease. I do have a few he could sit and press the button. Oh! <laughs> it works! <laughs> Here's your subtle amount of racism for the day. <laughs> you started with the door! I couldn't not, though. Hey, is this Hajime? I, to I told you. Or that's not what it says. I told you? <laughs> it's not even in the words! <laughs> I read loud as told. I can't also put a fucking filter on this. <laughs> loud and clear, it looks perfectly connected. That's a Ouija. And this is... How stupid are you, Hajime? Yeah, that's right. It's the way to communicate he was talking about. Alright! Looks like it's time for the ultimate mechanic to shine. While I also jack off in the background, you won't even be able to know. You can tell it's a 2D image too, because look at his shoulders. Yeah. Yeah. You can tell it's a 2D image. How about it? This is what I've been working on. <laughs> Remember that alley with all the shady looking street booths? That's where I found this. It's a surveillance camera for household use. I just tweaked it a little. Well, only a little. So now it's basically a video chat device. Well, it's pretty hit or miss. Video chat, huh? I get it. That's for you, Hiko. Alright, it's true. We don't have to worry about getting affected with this. That's right! So, it may be a hassle. <laughs> I thought it haste. But we'll be contacting each other like this from now on, okay? It may be a haste doesn't even make <laughs> sense know. as a sentence. I know. This is only a test this time, so I guess this should be pretty fun. Okay, then. See you later. <laughs> gotta get that, gotta get that, uh, voice modulator fixed. Yep, that moist, vo moist modulator. <laughs> <laughs> moist modulator? That sounds like Oh, it's so moist. Um, moist modulator. Moist modulator. <laughs> that sounds weird. What the hell is that? How's it you left this while you were arrested? Damn right. The surveillance camera unit comes with a surveillance camera and a surveillance monitor. No way. Anything else the camera records is broadcast live on the monitor. So we prepared the two of these set and swap each of the cameras. I see, by swapping the cameras, his monitor will display what's on my camera and vice versa. Apparently he also modified it a little. It widened its narrow communication range just beyond a household use. Even so. Even so, it still is a limit. So apparently the signal can't reach from the hospital to the motel. We can't communicate between the hospital and the motel. <laughs> you didn't notice? He was contacting you just now from the music venue near the motel. From there, the signal reaches the hospital with no problem. Wait. Sweet. Map, map, map. Okay. Yeah, How it's far? Well, I'm, I just want to see. I press fucking. No, you push the right button. I press the help button, which is very, very see, close. See, because there's the, the hospital. One. There's the set venue. And wow, the, the motel's on the opposite side. Wow, I didn't yeah. even notice. So it's just long enough to reach this. Probably long enough to reach the movie theater. Probably. Although and I highly doubt it. Possibly long enough to reach that. Electric Avenue, I think it's too too far. Just barely, maybe. I think it's too far still. Yeah, no, everyone's at the motel right now. Yep. Everyone there, anyway, and then the rest of the people are here. Oh, Dang. I wonder who's gonna. God, this is this is this is gonna be this is gonna be in like integral to know, especially when the murder <laughs> happens. We're gonna yep. need to know who's where and where was how and who has a despair disease. Yes, that's what I'm trying to figure out who has it now. Mm. There, the signal reaches the top hospital with no problems. 
They're staying in a motel, right? What happens if we can't reach them when we need to? Damn right. I thought the same thing, so we arranged times for us to contact each other. It's set up for us to communicate 30 minutes after Monokuma's morning and evening announcements. <laughs> Our next contact with him is gonna be tomorrow morning. Don't sleep in. He's well prepared. He is expected of an heir of an enormous organization. Huh? What's that? Nothing. Speaking of Bing bong. Speaking of evening announcements. Ahem. It is not Oh, but it doesn't say we no. have to sleep in our rooms. No. That's good. It's that time already, huh? No, then where should I sleep tonight? <laughs> Are you planning to use the on-call room with a certain someone again? Like I said, it's not what it looked like. You guys. Hey, hey! Aren't you misunderstanding? A hospital is a facility for sick people, so it's not for lodging for young and young romantic tyrists, you know. Or tyrus, trysts. You too? What are you talking about? I don't like this. Oh, I see. Your generation has fallen out of the habit of looking at bulletin boards. Come, come on, take a look at the bulletin board. There's a notice right there, right? Yeah, it's right there. Guess you gotta look at it. Wait, was this here before? Yes. Okay. I can't read it from here. It'll probably zoom in on it. Okay, I'll put up the problem. Eating and drinking is forbidden within the hospital building. If patients do not need to be accompanied, overnight stays by non-patients are expressly, expressly wow. forbidden. Wow. In other words... Right! It's not like the notices you often see inside hospitals. Or oh, it is like that! You can't stay overnight here. What are you saying? There is one patient who needs to be accompanied. Hmm. Oh, you're talking about Nagito, right? I'm being... And I'll allow just one person to accompany him. The rest of you need to hurry up and get out of here. Jeez. Hospital precautions my ass. You should have said so sooner. Only one person can stay tonight, and there's no way we can make Mikon leave. Jeez. Guess Good we have no thing. choice. We should head back to our cottages then. You're right. Even if we stay here, we probably won't be able to do anything. Yep. So that's a bad idea. All the way back. Yeah. Because you two could catch a disease. So Fuyuko and I are going to be the only ones to be in our cottages tonight. I'm a little worried. You now the ones who are stuck in the hospital should be more worried. What's the point of me getting so worried? Alright, when I wake up tomorrow, I'll go to the hospital right away. I feel bad making, leaving Nikon alone. I guess for now I should try to get some sleep. Try, anyway. Biggest word there. Monokuma appears! Good evening! It's time for Monokuma's cooking class! Today we're gonna learn how to make taiyaki! The first thing you'll need is... A time machine! We'll travel back in time from the Meiji period and meet a person named Seijiro Kanbe! He used to bake and sell turtle-shaped pastries, but unfortunately they never sold all that well. It's important you gently cheer him up because he's gonna be disappointed in himself when you meet him! From there, get serious and insist that he try to make his, fish, his pastries fish-shaped, cause they'll sell better! Once that happens, he'll happily bake his pastries in the shape of a fish! And as the final touch, name these pastries Taiyaki. Okay, with this you finished making Taiyaki! Not to you, but This concludes Monokuma's cooking class! He's not wrong, but it's not what he should have said. It's the most legitimate answer that taking literally you could possibly Yeah. Back ass. They'd be like way. they'd be like, I'm gonna make spaghetti I'm gonna go back in time to Italy and teach them how to make spaghetti. Or inspire them to make spaghetti. I'm gonna go to Italia and make them make pizza so I can get pizza today. But just one slice. <laughs> I'm worried about Mikan and the others. I should hurry over to the hospital. The moment I got out of bed, I immediately left my cottage and headed over to the hospital. Is everyone else there too, or no? Just no, sweet Eco and Mikan. Yeah, yeah. You came early today. You're the one who's early. Damn right. Well, I just got here. So what should we do? It's still a little bit of time before we need to make contact. Want to go to Nagito's room and check up on him? Yeah, I'm worried about how he's doing. Wait, right, why do I have to worry about a guy like him? You seem awfully worried. <laughs> Still, I mean, everyone has diseases. I'd be worried too. Uh, yeah, I'd be panicking probably. 
What would you do if you got disparages? What would your personality be if you got disparages? Well, I'd probably just be like very pompous and arrogant. What would I be? I'd be way too organized. You would be boring. I'd be boring and organized. <laughs> yeah, you would just be boring, organized, and just not care about anything. I already don't care about a lot of things, so... No, like, I mean, like, anything. Anything. That's a Buki, not Nagito. I want to check up on a Buki. A Buki? <sighs> yes, a Buki. I, I thought she was getting sleep. Did she just standing asleep like Chiaki? She was just standing the whole time. While sleeping. Yes. Chiaki can do it, I can't do it. My name is Ibuki Miyoda. Good morning. I am truly honored by you stopping by to see how I am doing today as well. Oh, really? Yes. As a token of my gratitude, I really want to sing a song. However, this is a hospital, so I must be quiet. Understood. If and when I am discharged, permit me to sing as you, uh, to you as a token of my gratitude. Well, the old Ibuki wouldn't have cared at all and just started singing. I really don't know how to react. Yeah, she's actually like... Normal. Fucking normal. <laughs> She's not OCD. <laughs> you mean ADHD. ADHD, yeah. She is not ADHD, nope. These guys aren't as bad as Nagito, but it doesn't seem like they're recovering either. Nope. Nope. I'm sure lots of people would be fine with a submissive Ibuki. <laughs> submissive is not the word I would use. Akane, however, is very submissive currently. She's like the new Mikan. No. Do you like Mikan? But Mikan's Mikan's submissive, but unintentionally. <laughs> <laughs> this hospital's scary. I was so scared I couldn't sleep. Now it's just now it's still Cosby. How <laughs> yes, oh, much longer do I have to stay here with the pudding <laughs> pops and? Uh... <laughs> Please don't. <laughs> hey, hey, hey! This is back when he was funny, man, and not. Controversial man. <laughs> um, well, is there any cure for this? Monokuma's the one who set this up, and that's all the reason we need to cure it. But I don't think you're gonna get a cure anytime soon. Probably not till the trial's starting. Yeah. Maybe not even then. Maybe not even till after the trial. Oh, God. You know what? That would be fucking. That would be weird and interesting. Everyone having flip personalities while in the middle well, no, of the trial. Well, no, only these people would, because everyone else is staying away Well, everyone else is sick. diseased. That's what I'm talking about. Hi, Mikan. Hmm? You okay there? How's Nagito doing? Um, same as usual. No, actually, he might be worse than yesterday. This is bad! Are you fucking serious? His pulse is extremely weak. He might slip into a critical condition sometime today. If I do it any higher, no. if I do it any lower, it's gonna become Chiaki. Is he that sick? But as long as I'm his nurse, I'll never let Nagito die. Ever! I do understand how you feel, but don't overexert yourself, okay? Hey, Ajime, it's almost time to start the connection. We need to head over to the lobby. Yeah, you got it. After being reminded of how powerless I am. What? I, I love mean, in treating people. Oh, okay. That makes easily. I can't actually help anybody here. I mean, no one can except Nikon, but Nikon can only try her best because she's the most medically inclined. She can try her bestest. Yes. She can give it everything she's got. It's healing time. No, I was gonna say it's treatment time. But treatment time works too. Because punishment, treatment, yeah. they they end with ment. It works better for the no. syllable wise count. Just shut up. Looks like they're already waiting. Let's hurry up and start the connection. If we just didn't answer, would they just think we're all dead? Yes. Um, I pressed the button underneath the blinking light. Seriously, it looks like a fucking fish. It is a fish. And the monitor instantly lit up. Looks like the camera and the monitor had no problem making a connection. But are are they powered? Are they wired or wireless? What are they powered on? And also, how strong is the connect? Like, what what's the bandwidth of the connection? And Why do you like give a shit about the bandwidth? Because I I, I want to know these things. So you can set up one for like. The other side of campus. <laughs> yeah, like I'm gonna talk to anybody outside of Just campus. Just in the room. The like, only hey, other Joe, people coming back up. Yeah, yeah, no, don't worry about it because I I know so many people in Reading. It's great because the other side of campus is in Reading. I don't, isn't it? No, the other side of campus is fucking Franco. I meant outside of the campus, Joe. 
Re Franco is still in the campus! I said the other side, not the outside of campus. I meant the outside, not the other side. You can sit up at the movie theater and be like, hey, John, I'm gonna stream the movie for you. That would be illegal. No, I'm watching it through a camera. But that would be it's illegal. It's not recording it, though. But it's still, it's still streaming it, which is a form of recording, which is illegal. No, wait, Soon wait. enough, a familiar face showed up on the other side of the monitor. It would be illegal if I record it while you're streaming it to me. It's still illegal. What's up? Hello? How is it? Can you see my handsome face? I somehow spit on the computer screen. Did you? Apparently. It's right there. <laughs> Good job. Yeah, I can see you real clear. <laughs> We're good on our end, too. I can totally see your broke-ass faces. That's great to say. What the fuck? It might be best if I tell the others about Nagito's condition. Hey, are you the only one over there? No. Well, we're all here except for Hyoko. What happened to Hyoko? <laughs> <laughs> it seems when we all look at Aberrant's enemy. Bleh. It seems we all look like Aberrant's enemies in the eyes of that coward. Um, she has locked herself in her room. She said from the other side of the door that she won't come out until the spare disease has been cured. So, how are you gonna get eat food? She's even being cautious around the others in the motel, huh? Looks like they're already in a test- they're also in a testy situation. Hey, hey. So how about you? How are you guys doing? Yeah, about that. To tell you the truth, Nagito's actually in serious danger- You. I already know he's- he's seriously dangerous. No, not that. He's seriously wandering on the border of between life and death. Trying her best. Hey, hey. First Nekumaru, then Nagito. This ain't funny at all. Well, for now, we can't really say. Yes. You can't really say that's impossible! Yeah, why are you on that side, Monami? Because it'd be dangerous if I got close to the hospital, since I don't even know what's going on there. You're really pissing me off. Like, why does a stupid stuffed animal need to be cautious about a disease? Disease that can even destroy this island. So until we figure it out how to deal with it, I will be on this side. Great. Blip. Blip. Before I can respond to Monami, Fuhiko had to cut the connection. Wow, really? Don't fuck with me. That shitty stuffed animal, she seriously pissed me off. Ah, oh, damn it. I'm going outside to cool off. Yeah, he probably spat those words before he went outside. All we can do now is wait. Wait patiently until the situation improves and changes for the better. So what are we doing? That's why we waited patiently, because waiting patiently was the only thing we could do. We waited patiently. On a side note, why can't I relax when I'm in a hospital? I paced back and forth around the hospital lobby. Fujiko entered and left the hospital many times. And time just kept passing by. Oh, no free time? Fuck you! It's already night time? What the fuck? <coughs> It is now. Please Jesus Christ. Your and relax. Let the snow bend, sweet dream. That was such a short day. Damn it. it. Feels like a lot of stuff got skipped over now and mm, wait. It's not yeah, now it's nighttime already. Yeah, you you think? Game breaking fourth wall again. It's almost time for tonight's transmission. Jeez. We should go back to our cottages when that's done. It's fucking annoying keep going back and forth, though. But before we go back, can we check on Nagito one more time? Go for it. Leave this transmission thing to me. Jeez. They're not gonna have a new clue anyway. I can handle this. Then I'll leave it to you. Go see Nagito. To. Toro. Did you just leave the hospital? Nope, you clicked the- uh, oh god, no! Get back in your room! Get back in your room, mate, lady. Whoa, Ibuki! What are you doing here? You need to be resting! Yes. To tell you the truth, I have been getting quite bored of doing nothing but sleeping. Also, it would just be trouble if you slept all the way, all the time, so I was hoping I can help you with anything. 
But it's better... But it's better if I am sleeping, correct? Yeah, just get some sleep for now. It'd be a big help if you got better soon. Understood. Yes, understood. It's kind Holy of scary. Holy crap. I hope she gets better real soon. That was creepy as fuck with her outline, too. That's... that's... not Nagito. I want to check on all of my best girls before I check on that dipshit Nagito. Now he's Valley Girl now, so now he's best Valley Girl. Fuck, <laughs> fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> it's not time again. It's so dark. It's so scared. I'm gonna get eaten by ghosts. <laughs> Usually she'd be more like, I'll beat the crap out of ghosts. How can I act like this? It just isn't Akane. No shit. I wanted to, I just wanted to get the dialogue. I like how she thinks she could get eaten by ghosts. Because she's a coward. She's more like the. Should I just give her Luigi's voice? Yes. <laughs> That's her, that's her anti akane voice. I, I, I don't know how Luigi's voice is gonna even be, but we'll find out. In the next, just kidding. She's too focused on caring for Nagito. She hasn't even noticed I entered the room. Has she been caring for him this whole time? Hey, Mikon. Hey, Mikon. No matter how many times I talk to her, she's not responding. Her back is turned towards me, she's focusing on caring for Nagito. I peeked over Mikan's shoulder and said, Hey Mikan, are you okay? Yeah, yeah she she didn't even yeah. notice. Looks like he finally noticed. Gah! Please don't surprise me! I almost got what? 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 I have questions! Uh, did you come by to check on Nagito? I just wanted to see how he was doing, but you look pretty tired too. Isn't it better if you get a little rest? Um, um, I hope I'm not mistaken. That'd be really embarrassing. Wait. Wait, what? What? Context. What? Uh, I'm confused. Are you by chance worried about me? Um, yeah, pretty much. Oh, thank you very much. I'll remember this moment until the day I die. <laughs> I'm starting to get my energy back, so I'll get back to taking care of Nagito. No, that's not what... I hope she understood what I said. That's, that's not what... She's working so hard. It'd be bad if I kept getting in her way. That's exactly how I felt, so I decided to just shut up and get back to the lobby. But... She told you she was going to get wet. I don't... From being so Oh hurt. my god, no! Oh my. What? Shut up. I wanna know what you're thinking! Mm -mm -mm -mm. I'll, 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 I'll. Everything will become clear. Will it? <laughs> everything will become clear. Alright. Yo, how's Nagito doing? I'm more worried about Mikan than Nagito. She, seems, she looks like she has had no time to rest. Damn it. Nagito's probably not doing so well. What about you? Are you guys done with the transmission? Jeez. As I expected, we wrapped it up quickly. It's like they had nothing new to report. They're apparently trying to find a cure somehow, but there hasn't been any progress. <laughs> so both, so both, so on both our ends, it seems like we had no results. Jeez. Oh well, let's look forward to tomorrow. With a depressingly heavy mood riding our backs, we headed back to our cottages. Are we seriously just going to be like this? Are you shitting me? <sighs> My worries have piled on so high that one sigh isn't enough. And the more I think about it, it's like I'm slowly being sucked deeper and deeper into an endless pit. I guess for today I should just go to sleep. It's best if I not dwell on it too much. And not just that. First thing in the morning, I need to go to the hospital again. I keep telling myself as I sighed one last time and slowly closed my eyes. Out of the blue, a hazy scene began to take shape. In the depths of my consciousness, it slowly took its time, hazily, like watercolor paint suspended in water. Slowly, hazily. Um. You don't have to say um after everything that happens, yes, I Joe. Do. It's it's no, you I, don't. It's my form it's of the not, disease. Yeah. I have the um disease. No, you can. You're not Jeff Goldblum. You can be quiet. <laughs> There was a classroom from somewhere. 
a classroom that I've seen before, but I don't know where. I can hear voices. Somebody's talking. Did you hear? Isn't it amazing? Apparently he's been accepted into Hope Seek Academy. But was he that exceptional? Those are noises. I'm dully staring at the window, pretending not to listen. I don't want to listen, but even if I don't want to listen, noises leap into my ears. Huh? You don't know? Heh, <laughs> know what? Apparently you don't have to be exceptional to get into Hope Speak Academy. But it's an academy that recruits only exceptional students from around the world, right? I wanted to cover my ears. I wanted to run. To the place I deserve to be. Not here. To the place where I can be more confident. Wow, I never knew that was po that way was possible. So he's the same too? Obviously. I mean, he doesn't have any special talents that Hope Speak would be interested in. He's just a normal guy who can be found anywhere. Well, admiring the Academy is free, but it's tough for the parents who have to write the check. Leave me alone. I just... I just want to become someone who's confident in myself. What is this anyway? Who are they talking about? Why can't I remember? Who am I? I mean, I think it's very obvious they're talking about you, Nagito. I mean, that's not Nagito. Hajime. Do you know that talking talking about a personal failure is a good way to break the ice when meeting new people? Is this so, I'm gonna tell you my story of personal failure. In the wild, wild world I live in, popularity is a symbol of power. That's why I decided to write a fake love letter to myself so I could brag about it to others. I was bragging about it to my friend, but unfortunately all I had was an envelope. When my friend wanted, to show, wanted me to show him the unwritten letter, I was in a real bind. So I showed him a blank piece of paper and said this. This letter was written with a special ink. Only those chosen by God can see it. <laughs> when I said that, he was all that love letter is brimming with passion. However, things started to look bad at that point. The others around us started praising him because they thought he really could read the letter. That's when he started hogging everyone's attention as the divine messenger of God. And eventually, he was worshipped by society! Now he uses his followers to sell CD bases for a quick buck! That's... weird. What? Thanks to my big mouth, he became a multi-millionaire! I'm regretful, what an epic fail! That was my story of a personal failure. What did, what do you think of it? Is the ice broken? Since you did, since you listened to me, wanna buy this vase? <laughs> it's in pretty high demand, and I'll give you a deal on it because I like you so much! Um, I'm gonna just keep saying, um, just keep saying, um, louder and louder yep. in the mic. Yep. That totally won't get annoying at all. Nope. Mm. It's morning, huh? But for some reason, my body's heavy. No. No, not just heavy. <laughs> oh, no. It's somewhat <laughs> soft and really hot. Oh, no. Wait a minute. What? No. Oh, no, not again. Oh my god, this happened again! You really wish you were Hajime right now, don't you? Shut up. <laughs> See, even his even his hair bone is a little bit uh, uh, confused. A, a yeah, confused is actually a better <laughs> word. No, stop. You're me. You gotta come full circle for this whole thing to work. Great way to end the episode. Again. Hurry up and move. How'd she get in the cottage? She probably got in because the lock was broken. Remember? Oh yeah, Boogie broke the lock. Wait. We're gonna end on that. <laughs> Best episode. Uh-huh. Best episode. Mikon stole the show twice now. Twice! God damn it, why did it she have to be so fucking cute? It wasn't with tripping and falling this time. Uh-huh. Why is she so fucking cute? Hmm. I'll see you guys later for more of this. <laughs> Boy! Hell, I'll even recap it with those images. Boy! I'll, I'll put it to some very fitting music.